video. In five, the video. Three, two. Guests are the lifeblood of a talk show. You know, we, we, we need them to keep going. Um, so we've been Zooming and that's amazing. And we were so happy with that. But to have a guest in studio is a game changer. When we first had Gate and Matarazzo on the show, it was literally, they were the kids from Stranger Things. They were kids, they were children. He's always, again, someone who I just look forward to talking to him and seeing what he's up to, and he tells me about new things that I don't know about. They're like like toddlers who love Stranger Things, who are just, yeah, they think it's like the bomb.com. But, but I mean, it is, but it's, it's a little scary. It's a little scary. Yeah, for a three-year-old. Sometimes, like, it's like people who don't speak, like, most words will look at me and just be like, Dustin. It was really cool getting to be back in the studio. I'm glad it's not as quiet as uh, it has been the past couple of months, and it's really cool to have people there. The energy's always great, and it feels like the old show. Michael Strand's been a friend of ours for a long time. He's always there and always down to do something different, something weird, something fun. This last time we played a game and he just uh, crushed me. Jimmy's going down in golf pong, guaranteed. <laughs> I'm gonna need a competitor worthy of the golf pong course. So ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the one and only Michael Strahan. <laughs> Every time I see Kevin Bacon coming up in the calendar, I get excited. He's so talented, he can, he can act, he can sing, and he can play. We are going to do another edition of First Drafts of Rock, and I think this is maybe our eighth or ninth time. It's just this goofy thing that we've been doing for years that, uh, you know, I, I, I've been so lucky to have been asked to be part of it because I got to, you know, sing and, and put on a, a wig and have a good time. We're doing the Allman Brothers uh, rambling in. Let's make it all about how he was born in the back of a Greyhound bus, you know, in his first drafts of the song. So the band's just playing and then he's singing and then I'm like, sorry, I'm sorry. Just to go back for a second, were you, you said you were born on a bus? These are rad. Awesome. So you just drew this up and then... Yeah. Fantastic, buddy. He's just good. Hey, all right. He's like a good, like, kid movie together. <laughs> <laughs> so good. Right? I've, never, I've seen you more, like, character than yourself. Honestly, though, this is the first time that I honestly don't think I would have recognized you. Really? Yeah, it's really good. <laughs> It'd be funny if he just kind of hopped up and down. That's not how he plays at all. It's first draft until now. guests that come in the more bits we can do uh, with the guests you know and it's just the show will just keep getting bigger and trying new things that's the next step I got my start uh, in stand-up and uh, that's my roots it's emotional in a weird way to have stand-up back because it means so much to me, but also means so much to New York City. Woo! Let's go! How you guys doing tonight? Shout out to New York City. We're coming back, baby. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. Thank you guys so much. I'm Mary Beth. Emmy Blotnick was perfect to come back and perform in front of an audience. To see her get those laughs, it's electric. It's exciting. I wish when I was a kid there'd been a, a sleep disorder Barbie. You know, just to get the image in your head, right? Just to see little girls being like, my Barbie likes melatonin. My Barbie smokes weed till she's tired. Whoa, Ken sleeps in a separate bedroom. <laughs> Thank you guys so much, I'm Emmy Blackman. It's an electric thing, it's so amazing. Because uh, during the pandemic, I got used to doing shows on Zoom. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. 
Oh, you crushed it. How did it feel? It feel good? It's unreal. That studio is beautiful. The roof, I can't believe it. It's, it's so a dream fun. Come true. It felt so good to say your name and you walk out from the curb. It was awesome. Oh my God. You crushed it, buddy. So you crushed it. Oh my really God. Honor. It's another piece to the puzzle. And um, it's been a tough year, uh, more than a year. And uh, it's, 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 I can see that we're going to come back.